I guess the, the key lesson is not only to be vigilant, but to research uh, the facility's history, to find out everything you can, both public, uh, that's publicly available uh, about the facility. Educate people what they're in for. I think you need to do due diligence. Are their charges reasonable? Especially now. You must see what they've been cited for. You must know what actions have been taken. What complaints have been lodged, if any. See what's going on, hear what's going on. I think they need to look at somebody's financial background. Did they just declare bankruptcy five or six years ago? Have they learned how to handle money? Now we've got patience. You need to see what their relationship with DSHS is. You know, regardless of how well we regulate, we will never be in a home every day. We won't even be there every month. And so again, the community uh, and you know, people who know about homes, they have to continue to report to us. I just can't stress enough to you know, be aware. And do your best to keep on top of that. Uh, but it's an ongoing process and, it, and it's very difficult. Her story can help shed some light for other people so that they can do what they need to do to protect their loved ones. I think that would please our mother.